Hi friends, it's Mrs. McCarver and it's time for today's reading lesson. This is an exciting day because we are starting a new unit in reading or we have something new that we're going to focus on for the next couple of weeks. So, this unit is all about the characters in some of our favorite books. We're going to be learning all about what we do as readers when we think about the characters in our books. But first, I want you to think, who are the characters in some of the books we've been reading? We've read a lot of books together this year. Here are some of the characters I thought of. I thought of Mrs. Wishy-Washy. Do you remember her way back in the beginning of the year? Oh, I thought of Big Al. Do you remember those books we read about Big Al and Shrimpy? He was a good friend, wasn't he? Maybe you remember Corduroy? We've read a couple books about Corduroy. Oh, maybe the Pigeon books. I know Mrs. O read quite a few Pigeon books to you. Maybe you've read some other books at home like Fly Guy. Or do you remember this character? We've read some different variations of her story, The Little Red Hen. Maybe here's another character you might know from books at home, Fancy Nancy. Pete the Cat, I know that's a favorite. Or Piggy and Elephant. Piggy and Elephant is a favorite for a lot of our friends too. All these characters come from books that we've read, but I know you've read lots of books at home that I probably didn't include their characters. So today I just want you to start thinking about some of these characters. In fact, I want you to think about your favorite character or maybe one of your favorite characters. I want you to send me a video telling me about one of your favorite book characters. Pick a character that you really like. It might be your all-time favorite or one that you're reading right now that you love and tell me about them. Can you tell me their name? Tell me about the book they're in and tell me why you like that character. Then when you go to the next slide, you're going to see a reading room full of books about these characters. You'll see it every day this week so that you can use some of those character books when we're thinking about our reading lessons. So today your job as a reader is to send me a video telling me about one of your favorite characters and why you like them and then go to the reading room slide on Canvas and listen to at least one book. Thank you and I can't wait to hear about your favorite characters.